Hello everybody. We decided to go up to Cradle Mountain for the day where we walked from Dove Lake up through Lake Lilla to Wombat Pool and to the base of Marion's Lookout. Then we went down alongside Crater Lake, down through Crater Falls and to the Waldheim Day Cabin where we had lunch. The weather was horrible, it was raining, snowing, the whole lot. It didn't get any higher than three degrees for the day, but we loved it. Hello everybody. Sorry about the wind noise, if any. It's Jason from J&J Explore. We're here today at Cradle Mountain doing a bit of a day walk. There's a lot of wind, there's snow on the ground, it's bitterly cold, it's only about three degrees. There's Wayne and Justine up in front. And uh, yeah, so we'll see how we're gonna go. Myself and Justine have got two ration packs to review. We have a chili ration, which is from Chile. It's a DAF civilian ration that Justine's going to do, and I'm going to do a Canadian IMP. So we'll see how that goes. Anyway, we'll see you on the track. Lovely little creek coming out of Lake Lilla. Yeah. We come past here in one of our earlier videos a couple of years ago when it was covered in snow. Marion's look out in the background. So we're going to head up over that way and just see what it's like up there. So we're going to go up over Wombat Pool, I think is the name of the little lake up the top of you. Right. Anyway, we'll see you when we get up there. Okay, we're nearly up the top to Wombat Pool anyway. That's looking back over Lake Double Lake and Lake Lilla. Hanson's Peak over the other side, they're getting pounded by the wind and Marion's look out up there, you can actually see people walking up the top so I don't think it's going to be pretty good up there but we'll see how it goes Anyway, next stop Wombat Pool We just made it down here to Wombat Pool where we're going to have a quick break and a drink and it's uh, starting to rain pretty heavy so we might stay here a bit longer Beautiful little lake. It's just been a bit of a let's get out and have a look around and use some of our winter gear. The wind's coming in pretty hard, a lot of cloud moving around. It's supposed to get more snow this afternoon, so we'll see. Justine giving us a wave. 
to do a ration pack review. Justine has got this one, which yeah. is uh, DAP. From Chile. From Chile. It's not Chile the food, but Chile the country. And I have a Canadian IMP, which is a Canadian one. It's hash browns and bacon. So, the rest of what they're like. Pasta. With this one's got pasta, pompadour, permadour, whatever, and it's got a lot of fruit and stuff in it. So. Apricot, crackers, berry jam, pineapple drink. So it's a really nice one. So, anyway, we'll get them apart and we can have a look. So she's opening the ration pack, and what have we got? Big. Big crackers. Coffee. Isotonic drink. Coffee. I know, I think they've got coffee, haven't they? Berry jam. That's a apricot syrup, pasta pompadour sauce, and the FRH. And FRH, and it's fork. Yeah, it's just and sugar. Sugar. So it's very light for a ration yeah. pack compared to that one. Open her up. Let's have a look inside. I've got to heat it up. Yep, yeah, we'll take yeah, we'll heat it up. That's the daft spoon, I've got one of them, these are really good. One is but there's more sugar in here. It's a shitload of sugar. Anyway. The chili tapper. Oh. And Wayne's got an Australian ration pack, Reggie Might Sanger. <laughs> but uh, so now I'm gonna open up this Canadian one. What other Aussie delights have you got, Wayne? This is the dessert, which is <laughs> sliced pears. Sliced pears? I have apple, brown sugar, crunchy cereal. Wow. I have lemon lime. juice, lemon and lime. That's I an have isotonic have drink. Plain hamburger bun. Mm. They're I giving them matches. Another lemon and lime. I have a performance bar. Could have done with that um, an hour ago. Roasted coffee. Um, where else? Chocolate oh. drink. Uh, ketchup. Sugar. And. Well, I mean, look at the stuff in there. The main meal, which is the hash browns and potato and bacon. So. And more coffee. Look at all your stuff in there. Oh. Mine. And a couple of Tic Tacs. Oh, no way. <laughs> so, 
<laughs> anyway, if it, we'll tastes, if it up. tastes horrible, you've got some minced clean. You get these now. heated up. Now, the Canadian ones, for some reason, don't come with an FRH, so I have a good old Kiwi made Australian issued FRH. These are the business. So we'll get these heated up and we will get come back. <laughs> Justine's <laughs> FRH is cranking away, heating up her food. So uh, she's just having to go up the. Um, I put one of these big crackers, it says, in the berry jam, which is like a liquid. There it is. But it's really tasty. It's nice and sweet, that stuff. Yeah. I'll save you the biscuit for me coffee. <laughs> Justine's <laughs> food is ready and the test. Pasta with tomato and bits of carrot. Perfect. Tasty. Yep. That's all right. So they reckon these DAF MREs are probably the better ones to have, but the Americans ones taste real chemically. I can't say the Canadian because I haven't had it yet. But There's no preservatives in this one either. No. That's really good. It's just got tomatoes, water, pasta, carrot, onion, sunflower, oil, vegetable oil. <sighs> Sugar, oregano, and salt. Mm. And Wayne's got the good old fashioned two-minute noodles. Bloody good stuff. And my my FRH is cranking away. So, and mine will be ready in a minute. So, the verdict, Justine, very good. Mm. I don't like all the meat ones, so. It's um, really good. It's mm. not spicy or anything. Okay, so my one's ready. I'm gonna tear the top off. And the ash browns. And you'll see what these things are like. So. Doesn't look too bad. The hash browns and bacon. Bacon looks bloody awful. Mm -hmm. That was hash brown and bacon, what you're eating. Mm. Is that what was in that bowl? Yep. Hey? Was that what in that bowl? Yep. Hash browns and bacon. Really? It's very nice. Right, Justine's eating the peaches and no, your thoughts. Apricots. Uh, apricots, yes, apricots. And biscuit, I've just eaten the biscuit now. And the biscuit and all that, so. This is really tasty and really nice. Yeah. I think the chilli ration packs are the best. It tastes really fresh. Yep. And um, tastes like pureed apricots. Not bad for something that's got a three year shelf life. No. Mm. Right, I just had my hash browns. The hash browns were really good. Um, I'm not going to eat much more. I might have a go at the peaches on the drink, and that's about it. Mm. Oh. Oh. <laughs> not bad. So now we're going to pack up and we're going to head back to the visitor centre and get a coffee and probably head home. Get dry. And get dry. As we left the Waldorf Day Hut, we found this across the road. If you can take it in, take it out. Don't be a douchebag.